Hello, peeps. Hello. How's it going? How's it going? Welcome, Twinkly, Danny, Marlon, Josie, Carolyn, Tiny Chico. Hello. I think I said, I think I got everyone there. I'm glad your internet's working for now, Marlon. Um. <laughs> so, who wants a game? Josie, are you in? Or we're gonna have to start with that. Yeah, it's just gonna be me and me and Marlon. Heads up. I know uh, it's a bit awkward for a few like UK regulars in the stream. So uh, th like there might be a few less people here, but I'm sure we'll be fine. If need be, we could always just, um, we could even jump in to like online games with other people or, or, or we could include, nah, I don't want to include bots. Bots, we don't want bots. How's everyone doing anyway? How is everyone doing this fine Thursday evening? Ba -da -ba -ba -dum. Hey, Al, how's it going, man? How was your holiday? Booting up. Right, we'll wait for Josie then, definitely. Um. Yeah, it feels like ages since I've had a chat with you, Al. Ba -ba -do -ba -do 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 -do. Oh, Al, Al, I just saw Al log in. He's out. He's gonna have a few games with us. Very nice, very nice. Been slacking. <laughs> nah, nah, he's just been there. Uh, Chilling, enjoying, enjoying the sun, and and by the sounds of it, crazy busy at work as well. Bum, bum, ba -da -bum, ba -da -bum. Hear the man bear the let that green screen though. Oh yeah, have you not seen? You must have seen the. Uh... Have you seen the green screen before? I'm trying to think. Yeah, you must have. It's my favorite time of the month watching people play games with viewers while you sit there not having the game. Oh, <laughs> it sucks. Have you got a Switch, Tiny Trico? Uh, like, have you got a Switch but haven't got this game, or you just not got a Switch at all? Uh, Lisa's in the house too. Been a damn long time, dude. <laughs> Man, okay. Yeah, have you? Uh, I know you've probably been busy. Um. Right, Josie, come on. Etanosa, hey, long time no see, Etanosa, how's it going? I remember you from a, a, uh, a Mario Kart stream a while ago. Jump in if you want to. Go easy on me. Oh, there we go. We've got a couple more names in the... Uh, I'm just waiting for Josie because he it literally just said he came online. I don't know if he's having problems or not. Hello. Oh, there you are. Oh, okay. You've changed your avatar. <laughs> no wonder. I did. Oh, God. Okay. Right, let's just go. Where's Mike today? I don't know, I don't know. Maybe he'll be here later. It does seem really quiet tonight. But I mean, we've we've literally, like, we started like two minutes ago, so I'm sure people will arrive. We're going for a bit of baby park. At least Halo 5 doesn't leave me. <laughs> what? Yeah, so, um, oh, not the womp. Not the womp runes. Um, yeah, I finally decided I've been like stressing all week. So last week we finished streaming Wind Waker um, And I've been stressing all week thinking what what am I gonna stream? What am I gonna stream? And it's, it's so hard like I, I Honestly, it's the it's the thing I find hardest of of the whole YouTube thing which sounds silly a lot of people probably think well, What's the you know, how hard is it to just pick a game? Um but honestly, the thing I find the hardest um, of all this, look at my rocket ship, by the way, peeps. Um, oh, what the hell? <laughs> that power slide. What the hell? This handles like a tank. I've never actually used this before. I was just, <laughs> I was just looking at the different cars before we started, and I thought, that looks alright. Clearly not. Not so much. Okay, a bit rusty. Um... Yeah, so, uh, like, a lot of people would think this sounds weird, but honestly, one of the things I struggle... What the hell? This can This this bike cannot power slide. I'm changing my, uh... <laughs> I'm changing my vehicle. Um... What on earth? Actually, though, to be fair, it is only 100cc, so... I can probably just go around corners at full speed. Oh. Is there only five of us? Am I in last place? Do, do, do. Not for long though. Yoink! See you later, Josie. Anyway, yeah. 
So one of the things I find really tricky is kind of knowing what games to stream. Um, it's because it's like, a, it's a really tough, like, balance act. Like, I've said for, for, for as long as I can remember that I don't just want to stream whatever's popular. Like, if, like if, if the games that are really popular at the moment happen to be games that I want to stream as well, then that's great. But I don't, what I mean is I don't want to stream games that I don't like just because I know it'll make people turn up. Um, because that's no fun for me, is it? <laughs> I don't want to play games I don't want to play. So, um, so yeah, so it's got to be like a game that I want to play, but it's also got to be, like, I'm not totally disrespectful of you guys who are here watching and stuff, so it's got to be something I want to play, but it's also got to be something that you guys want to watch. LOL. Coming for ya. Um, this seems really slow. I'm sure we, we must normally play on 150cc. I think I've made a boo-boo here. This feels really slow. Like, so much so that I don't even need to power slide. It just it seems, it feels weird. Um, yeah, so it's got to be something that everyone likes, me and the viewers. Um, and that's sometimes quite tricky, because, like, so often I'll be like, Oh my god, yeah, I've just, you know, I really fancy replaying this RPG that I loved as a kid. And then I realize that no one else likes it. And no, no, one else has even, no one else has even heard of it. And I'm just like, I'm going to start this 50-hour RPG that everyone's going to be like, what's this? Um, so yeah, I've got to find a, a nice balance. Ah, fair, I'll take it. Only a few folk, you might actually get a win. Oh, don't know, not when Marlon's around. Yeah, sorry, I, I didn't recognize your uh, avatar, Josie. You must have changed it. Stopping by to say hello real rolls quick. in. Might join you for a quick Eng when the England game finishes. Yeah, let me know how it's going, because I was... Um, I was paying attention to that until I literally had to start. Oh, <laughs> unlucky Lisa. <laughs> to be fair, la I mean, fifth sounds a lot better than last. Um... um yeah, let me know how the England game's going, because I had to, like, I, st I had to start streaming it, and it was still extra time. Watch the first episode of Papers, please. Yeah, that game is very interesting. Ow. <laughs> it's, um, like, it was totally, uh, it was Emma's idea, and I just kind of, I trust Emma, so I went with it. Even though it looked really, like, weird and really not my thing at all. Um, I quit my nap for this. <laughs> um, yeah, it, it, like on the face of it, it just seems quite boring, and, like weird. And um, I tell you what, your lamp quote is famous now, Al. People are hammering it while while you've been away. People hammering the lamp, um, <laughs> the lamp sound effect. Um, yeah, so um, yeah, I thought, oh, this is pr this is mental. This is like the weirdest game ever. I'm not gonna like this. Um, but I, you know, I had faith in Emma. Um, and it's so good. Like, you would think, I don't know, you would think, oh, come on, don't. Oh, I just about got the boost. Um, you know, you would think that it sounds like quite a weird and potentially boring, like, topic. But, um, I don't want to spoil too much because, you know, you'll see yourself. But, um, it gets, I, I think it gets really good. Come on! Power slide like you've never power slided before, Link! Oh, not into a wall, though. Nope. Go, go, go! Oh, man. <laughs> um, stream Uncharted 3. I, that was one of my considerations, it was, actually. Because um, I've streamed the other two. Um, but yeah, so I was thinking, oh, you know, what, like... And especially, I, I, first of all, I thought, oh, maybe I'll do Doom 2016. But then I did a poll on the Discord, um, just, like, it, it wasn't, like, specifically, like, oh, I'm gonna pick what the next game is based on this poll, but I thought, you know, good to get an idea of what kind of games everyone likes, um, you know, and I put up, like, turn-based RPGs and, um, you know, turn-based RPGs, fighting games, platformers, you know, I put pretty much every kind of genre of game up on the list and 
first person shooters got <laughs> was like rock bottom. So that I, so I ruled out Doom on account of that. Um, fire! Oh man, I, I was going to say how did I miss everyone, but I just managed to get Josie. I'm doing so bad. This this is the worst car ever. I think I've made a serious mistake <laughs> with this car. Um, you do need to catch my papers, please. Um, I won't spoil anything, but um, I mean, I've, I've not. This isn't a spoiler, as such. But basically, there's loads of different endings you can get, as I'm sure you know, Josie. And um, I'm going to be doing a second playthrough to get some more of them. That's all I'll say. <laughs> come on, don't come last. Oh my god, I can't power slide. This is like. Do, do cars have a power slide stat? Because if they do, this is like zero. Um, Eco, Shadow of the Colossus, Last Guardian series would be a good show, man. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Like, I definitely want to do those. Um, at least like Shadow of the Colossus. You like watching retro games, Twinkly? What kind Lost of um, lamp. What kind of console? Are we talking like SNES or like are you a Nintendo kind of person or Sega or? Like how far, how far retro are we talking? I have heard about your different voices in the papers, please. <laughs> yeah, it's like some kind of like oppressive Russian government. That's uh, yeah, it, it's a crazy game. No reason for me today. Got to go grocery shopping. Oh, life, life, so boring. <laughs> oh well, we're not gonna play for too long anyway. Anyway, the whole point of me saying this was that, you know, I've been throwing around all kinds of ideas, and I even thought, um, a wild thought. Have you played any GBA games? No, I, I haven't me actually. Out. Oh, God. <laughs> That's not the sound effect I want to hear. Um, <laughs> me singing to myself. Um, um. Yeah, so I went through all kinds of like possibilities of stuff because so the most popular games. I mean, let me know what you think. But the most popular games, based on like what people said in the Discord, were ah oh, turn-based RPGs, action RPGs. So kind of um, like Oblivion and Final Fantasy 15 and I guess like Kingdom Hearts is an action RPG and stuff. Um, so stuff like that. So. Oh, action RPGs, turn-based RPGs, platformers, which I was quite surprised about. Um, these are these are the most popular ones. Um, simulators, which was e which was the most surprising of them all, but to me anyway. Um, simulators was like right up there. And sorry, Marlin. Yoink. <laughs> sorry. I'm sure she'll get me back. Now I've just got to beat Al to get my first win. Oh, come on. I, I must be, like, driving a toy car. Everyone... <laughs> this is so slow. Handles, like, amazing, in a way. Because um, I'm going so slow. I can just <laughs> cruise around every corner. Get out of my way, peeps. Get out of my way. I need a weapon. Oh, I'll take two. Right. Let's get a red shell for my boy Al. No! Sorry, Josie. <laughs> yeah, so I was going through all kinds of games. I was thinking, what games do I fancy playing um, that kind of fit into these categories? Um, and so I was thinking, I had a brilliant idea. That it, was, it felt like a brilliant idea at the time. Um, <laughs> to do like a blind playthrough. It would pretty much be a blind playthrough of Skyrim. Um, so I've started I've started Skyrim before, but I didn't get far at all, and I gave up on it because basically I started playing it like just after I'd put like 200 hours into Oblivion. Um, so I was kind of I was just Elder Scrolls out. Is that a word? Elder Scrolls out. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know if Elder Scrolls. So I um, so by the, yeah by the time I got to Skyrim, I was just. I couldn't hack it, and I just stopped playing. Um, no, don't get me with your stinking red shell. <laughs> um, yeah, so I really want to go back and play Skyrim. So that would be, like, pretty much a blind playthrough, which is pretty cool. I mean, there's not many people, I guess, who can do a blind playthrough of Skyrim these days. 
Come on. How many red shells do I have to hit him with? No! Oh! Oh! Oh, he just got over the line. I was slowing down, so it tried to so it get him and not me, but he was too quick. The voice is great. <laughs> have you, yeah, I haven't played any GBA games. Have you got any um, any GBA games in mind that are kind of you think are good? I know I definitely want to play. Still, still rooting for Baby Park. Come on, Baby Park. Actually, that was a really bad idea because um, I can't power slide. <laughs> um, in this car, I just can't power slide, and Baby Park is just like one big power slide. And I still <laughs> three red shells and a blue shell, and I still want outrageous. Might be interesting to watch someone actually finish the main quest because I never do. The main quest of what? Oh no. Um. Outrageous. I need to um. <laughs> I know, I'm so far behind now, I don't know what game you were talking about, Hyper. Tied first, coming for ya. Oh, the main quest of Skyrim. Yeah, I've, I've, well, I've, I'm far, far <laughs> from doing that. Um, but yeah, so I thought that'd be really cool to, like, like a full blind playthrough of Skyrim. Because I love those kind of games, It's and it's like... I feel like it fits in with a lot of what people like. I, I like it, and a lot of what people who are, you know, around on the channel like. Kind of, you know, it's got leveling up. It's got a lot of, like, lore and story to it. It's got cool fighting and magic and dragons. And, you know, it's just a cool game. And, um... The only thing that put me off that was a, a little bit was I just thought, like, if I stream four hours a week, you know, <laughs> how many <laughs> am I going to finish it in 2019? Um, it's a pretty big game. Oh, lucky out. It had to be this way, I'm afraid. Is this going to be my first win? No, get out of it. <laughs> oh my god. So close. Oh, no. Mate! Oh, I just hit Mike with a green shell! This is mayhem. This track is always mayhem. Oh, how did I just go from first to fourth in, like, seconds? Come on, I need a weapon. Like, a good one. Like, now. No! Who did that to me? Is that you, Al? No! Oh, fifth! Outrageous. Oh. I'm here now, audience member only. <laughs> no worries. Hello, Carolyn. How's it going? I hope your uh, cooking of supper went well. Exactly right. Skyrim never ends. Well, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I can't stream it forever. But yeah, even just to do... I mean, I've never finished it before, but I've heard people say it's huge. Um, and before someone says I've been practicing. <laughs> yeah, I've been practicing. Right, I, I'll tell you what I am, though. I'm changing my car. This is not working out for me at all. I don't know why. Like, grip handling. No, there is no stat. I'm, we're going for 150cc next time, I think. If everyone's happy with that. Uh, that's a bit weird. I don't know what I'll... I, I'll oh, that's pretty nice. A little Formula 1 car. Why don't we do teams? Yeah, I'm game for that. Um, oof. I don't want too too much speed. Oh, I want to get a nice pink airplane. Well, there's six of us, so it's perfect to do teams. So we do 150 CC team game sorted, and I'm just gonna do random. So whatever the teams are is what it is. Okay, because that's the fairest way, isn't it? Rather than me swapping around. So it's me, Marlon, and Lisa against Josie, Al, and Mike. I think they're actually pretty good team, pretty like even teams actually. I think if you stuck to only the main quest, the game wouldn't be longer than say a Zelda game. Oh wow, really? Okay, I'm quite shocked about that. Um, I wouldn't, I did, like, I wouldn't want to totally do that because just because you know, Skyrim's not there to be like. Skyrim's the kind of game where you know. You gotta do some side quests. I, I you know, I'm, I'm not gonna like platinum it or anything, but uh, you know, you gotta do a bit of uh, extra stuff. Um, 
Yeah, okay. I mean, if it was... You know, if I could get it done in 30, 40, 50 hours, that wouldn't be too bad. Um, but yeah, I wouldn't want to have to kind of rush it, because I know it's such an epic, massive game and stuff. And that, um, by the way, my friend wasn't able to join today after all. Family thing showed up. Oh, I was going to ask. No worries, no worries. You know, sometimes life pops up. Come on, Lisa. I'm going to do this. Oh, we can't have... Ow. Stinking ow. <laughs> Leading the way. How's the England game going anyway, if anyone knows? I'm I'm much happier with this car. Anyway, so that's what I was saying. I was saying about how hard it is to um, to pick games sometimes. So the the game that came to mind today, and it was oh, was that you, Al? Rotten. Um, yeah, the game that came to mind today was Grandia 2, and it was mostly it came to mind because I saw. Like a tweet saying that, just confirming again that they're going to be bringing a collection out, like a HD collection soon of um, Grandia 1 and Grandia 2 on the Switch, which is going to be amazing. Um, I haven't played the first one, but I've played the second one and that was pretty amazing. Um, one of my favourite RPGs ever, and we are literally 4th, 5th and 6th girls, come on. <laughs> Gotta do something better here. Need some weapons. Well, I've got them now. Right. See if Al can survive three red shells this time. And a blue shell again. No! What? No! Don't come last. Don't come last. Oh. I think I just managed to hold on to fifth place. Okay, what does that add up to? That can't be that much of a difference. Oh, okay. It's worse than I thought. <laughs> So it was two, a 2-1 two Dutch. Oh, no, really? Back now. Let's just say that you haven't missed that much. England was England as per usual. Sunday league at its finest. Sounds <laughs> sounds great. At least it's a cup that I've never even heard of. Like, <laughs> it's, it's a nothing cup, is it? Um, two howls. 3-1. Um, oh, jeez. Yeah, I mean, like, if it was the... If it was the Euros or the World Cup, I'd care, but, eh. Yeah, you might be right, though, Hyper. Maybe do some some bits. Like, I don't... I'll maybe do... not. I guess not, like, um, side quests off-screen, but I could do, like, the boring, grindy smithing and stuff off-screen. Basically a pointless tournament. Winner doesn't even get a guaranteed Euro space. What? I thought the, <laughs> I thought that was the whole point. I thought the winner got a guaranteed Euro space. I mean, not like we need that anyway. In like England, we might be garbage in tournaments, but we're <laughs> we're pros at qualifying. Like we are rock solid when it comes to qualifying. Um. All right, come on. Oh, trying to throw a banana at mate. Something tells me we're going to struggle. Oh, yes. <laughs> I was just going to say something struggle tells me we're going to struggle to beat Might, and then someone whacked him. I'll take it. Um, yeah, so it really is a pointless tournament then, isn't it? <laughs> like, even more pointless than I thought it was. Oh, someone's... No! Everyone's shortcutting. But no chance when I don't know the shortcuts. Oh, yes. That's what I'm talking about. No, that's not what I'm talking about. Yeah, so... Um, going through all these ideas. I could do Doom. I could do... Skyrim. I could do... I don't know. I could do Fallout. I could do... Um, all sorts. Mass Effect. Um, Shadow of the Colossus. Although I'd have to buy that because I haven't got all the other games I mentioned. I already have them. But I'd have to buy Shadow of the Colossus. Which I do want to do at some point. 
Come on, I've just, I've got to beat Al. That is the goal. Oh no. Let's take him out of action. Go on. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, Al. No. No. Come on. No, don't you. Okay, that's not for me. Oh, someone stole my shells. No. No one. Come on. I'll take it. Hello, John Ninja. How's it going? <laughs> Sorry about that. Just stressed it over trying to get a half decent result in Mario Kart. I'm Dutch. Are we losing something? No, you're winning something, Twinkly. You just beat England in a kind of pointless um, <laughs> football tournament. Hey, look at this. Neck and neck. Come on. Winner isn't guaranteed a place. Stole your shells, mate. How dare you, Josie. <laughs> you should do cheese, law cheese land to keep the theme of the channel alive. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's find cheese land. On the GBA as well. Tiny Trico is just talking about GBA games. Yeah, you won, Twinkly. Yeah, I'm doing good. Doing good. Just chilling with a bit of Mario Kart. Have you got this game, by the way, John Ninja? Because if you have, you can jump in. By the way, the game didn't connect me, comma. That's weird. How's it going, bird? What's up? Um, I was just I was just about to mention you actually about the uh, the fact that you're going to be streaming Resident Evil 2 soon. Unhook my Everybody's heard grid. about the bird. I got too excited. <laughs> everyone has heard about the bird, and everyone has now heard that he's going to be live streaming Resident Evil 2 blind playthrough. Um, and he doesn't like horror games. Bird is desperately trying to get his Final Fantasy 7, and I do not know why it's not working. <laughs> oh god, Emma said she moved the sound effects folder, didn't she? But then, Lamp and Al's intro are working. And I think Marlon's intro worked? And Bird's intro worked. I don't know. At least you've got your bird. Everyone has heard about the bird. Most has managed to get in anyway, see? And join our team, thankfully, because we need all the help we can get. How am I, how am I so far behind? Yours where? It's not working for moderators? Really? It's weird. Coming for you, Josie. Yeah, so anyway. I've, it's the kind of, oh my god, how many stars am I going to get? <laughs> not not going to complain, but it's a whole lot of stars. Right, Lisa's on my team. Don't hit her with a shell. Oh, man. I can see three red. I'm in sixth, and I can see three red people, which means <laughs> we're like fifth, seventh, and sixth or whatever. Not going good for team red. I hope you're making up making up for it, Marlon, and winning. Um, yeah, lots of options, and you just, it's so easy to kind of, um, to think, oh, I just fancy playing this game, and I know that there's a, there's an element of, like, I should just play literally whatever I want, but there's got to be a, um, as I say, I don't just pick games that other people, that, that I know are going to get views, but at the same time, it would be pretty stupid and selfish for me to be like, hey, I I'm going to sit here and play Minesweeper because I really like it. I don't care if anyone else does. <laughs> like, you know, I like it. I want everyone else to have fun as well. Come on. Just go. <laughs> that was a weird little way to end. <laughs> Who's on your team? Um, Stardust, which is Marlon, um, Morris, and Lisa. Reds against blues. God, it moves really fast. Oh, it's still close. It's still close. Come on. It's going to come down to this last race. So worried about playing Resi 2. Did you play the demo, by the way? I assume you're playing the, the kind of fancy. We're going for Cheese Land again. As per John Ninja. Um, did you... Yeah, I assume you're playing... It's like, Marlin! The fancy... Um, the fancy remake. Um, and if so, did you... 
Um. Um. I love did, lamp. Did, did you play the thirty-minute demo? Because I played the thirty-minute demo and my art was really good. Um. Like it's crazy how I mean Al can tell you how good it was. Um. Minesweeper. <laughs> Um, mine stream a stream when. Um, I don't know if I saw how it worked because I didn't. I didn't use it. Yeah, it works fine there. Bird's gonna love it. I can feel it. I think he will. I don't think. Well, I haven't seen. I've only seen like I saw the half an hour that I did, and I saw at least like an hour or two of you streaming it out. Um, although. <laughs> I did see like large parts of what I saw you streaming was just one boss, if I remember rightly. Just fails on one boss. It's like a Dark Souls stream. Um, ba -dum -ba. I love this track. Um, yeah, I think you'll like it. I like it. yeah. So from what I've seen, it wasn't that scary. It's not like um, it's not like Outlast or anything. Or is it? I don't know. <laughs> Dark Souls streams are the best. I know, like, that was even, you know, I'm saying about I couldn't, kind of didn't know what to stream tonight, tomorrow. And, um, even that was a consideration. I thought, you know what, should I just, should I just, like, live stream Dark Souls 1 or something? Even though, like, I kind of, you know, I've completed Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3 twice each now. Um, so I'm not like a noob to any of them. Sorry, Al. <laughs> Two in a row. Um, yeah, I'm not a noob to any of them. But I mean, God, I've completed Cuphead enough times on stream. Um, like, I reckon I must have completed Cuphead on stream. Never mind the times I've completed it off stream. Must have completed it on stream at least five times. Easily. Oh. Oh, and I just don't seem to be able to catch up on anyone. Despite the fact I seem to have like an infinite supply of mushrooms. Bum, 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 ba -da -ba -da -bum. Right, come on, let's red shell them. And again. And leave it a little bit longer so it's got time to hit them. Oh no! It's gonna hit me! No! Oh wow, somehow I managed to dodge that. I don't know how. Oh! No! No! I hit my eat, but um. Then he hit me, and then Josie robbed it at the end. Well played, Josie. Hey, Scouse, don't even to the stream was out of martial art training. Okay, no worries, no worries. What kind of martial art do you do, Catagon? Oh, I think Blues have robbed it, you know. Oh, look at that. Two points in it. Two points. Well played, Team Blue. To be fair, they won with one less player, so it's kind of like an even bigger win. Oh, our, our top players though, Stardust and Mar and Might were like neck and neck. Aikido, oh cool. Same as uh, Steven Seagal. The pain, the rage, the trolls, the victories as a blind through playthrough that amazing. Yeah, yeah, it's the kind of, it's almost like the, um, when you, um, oofies my back hurts. <laughs> Outrageous. Hey, Ace, how's it going, man? Um, leave a like, by the way, peeps, if you're enjoying the stream. Click the like button. Keeps me happy. Tells YouTube that we like the stream and want to share it with other people. Stardust and Marlin, I noticed that. <laughs> Stardust and Marlin, killing it. Right, we're just going to do teams again and we'll, we'll do whatever happens. Oh, really? <laughs> All right. I am... Um... It is what it is, but I'm really bad. I should be. I should not be on the team of three. Like the team of three needs to have a superstar. I mean, well, we've got Marlon, but the team of three pretty much needs to have two superstars. Hey, Claudio, how's it going? Are you uh, are you up for a few games? I know you mentioned on um, Discord you might join us for a couple of games. If you are, that would level up the teams to four all. That would make things a little bit nicer. Still happy about what me and my friends did to you all. <laughs> Still celebrating. Oh, Marlon's gone for Baby Park. Yeah, Claudio. Literally, all you have to do. Um, my friend code is there. 
if you add me, then you can automatically join whenever. Um, oh, I hate Rainbow Road. I hate it. Every form of Rainbow Road, I hate them all. <laughs> um, yeah, just add me. The the friend code's at the top. Add me on... Um, in fact, I think you've already added me, haven't you? And you have, because there is your name just popped up. Um, to say that you're online. Um, yeah, so just jump in whenever you want. Um, and you'll just kind of automatically be placed in the next race. Um, like, we're doing teams at the moment, like a team Grand Prix, but there's only seven of us, so it means that it's like three against four. So if you join, it will automatically put you on the team of three, and then that'll level level the things, scores of it. Because at the moment, I'm on the team of three. So I need all the help I can get. See them cheeky little, uh, cheeky little shortcuts. Got the skills. Got you already. Um, yeah, so I considered doing Dark Souls again, even though I kind of know it all inside out and yada yada yada. It's still fun. And it's not like, you know, it's not like I know it so well that I'll do like a deathless run or whatever. I'm not that good. Um, you know, I'm still gonna die. <laughs> Probably, I'm still gonna die quite a bit, I would imagine. Um, but, you know, I don't know, it's just the game's just fun. Oh, that was such bad time and ba -da -da -da. These power sliding skills. Give me something good. Star, I'll take it, I'll take it. Yoink! Oh, there's a blue shell coming for someone. Ah, oh, someone stole my weapon. My potential weapon. Come on. Got to get some kind of respectable finish here. I've been doing terrible tonight. Oh, why did I not save that for the shortcut? I'm so stupid. Might's about to drop a banana. Oh, Might just fell off. Oh, no. Might fell off and gave me the second place. Unlucky Might. I wouldn't mind the Dark Souls stream, but only if your class is deprived. I mean, deprived doesn't... Everyone goes on about deprived, but I think once you get good at the game, deprived can't be that much of a disadvantage, right? Because... I think you don't start with a weapon, right? But, um, you find one anyway, and then you start like a slightly lower level, but then it's obviously easier to get levels because it costs less souls to get the levels and that. Like, is it that big of a disadvantage, do you reckon? Or am I missing something? Maybe I'm missing something. Hey, light blue, blah, blah, blah. Light blue Yoshi, how's it going? Long time no see. Jump in, jump. Light Blue Yoshi, if I remember, is an absolute beast of this game. So, whoever's got him on their team is uh, going to be a happy chappy. Are you going to play Crash Team Racing and online? If so, which console will you buy it on? Um, I wasn't planning on buying it, to be honest. Um, I've never played a Crash game, and I've never played a Crash Team Racing game either. Um, so, I, like, I, I wasn't planning on getting it, to be honest. I take it you're a fan, though. I wish I could help as I'm quite good at Mario Kart 8, but unfortunately I don't have Nintendo online. Oh, that sucks. I love that. I like, a lot of people don't like the kind of, uh, like, uh, you know, are, are not fans of the whole Nintendo online thing. I think it's kind of, it's pretty good. Like, you know, the, there's, a, there's a bunch of stuff that they need to improve, but I, I don't know, maybe, I guess it depends on how much you like retro games, because I quite like it. A few of the online, the um, you know, the stuff in the online NES Switch thing. Um, so that's quite good. I play them a fair bit. Um, you know, I've completed like since getting the online thing, I've completed Mario Bros. One, two, three, Zelda one, two, um, Punch Out, um, and I've played a bunch of like Ninja Gaiden and stuff. Um, so I, I think that's quite good and. Having the online thing gets you access to Tetris 99, which is ama <laughs> amazing. Like, honestly, I've put more I've put more hours into Tetris 99 than some games that I've paid for. So good. Again, though, I am just a big fan of Tetris. So if you're not, then <laughs> you might not feel the love like I do. Oh, get off the sand! Get off the sand! Oh no, I've royally messed up for the team. Sorry, peeps. The least I can do is beat Josie. First time for everything. That is true, that is true. What console are you getting it on then? 
Yoink. I'll just scooch across there. Thank you. Ooh, what the hell? What is wrong with my steering tonight? Yoink. Come on, I cannot come last. That is outrageous. I've got two blues in front of me as well. Two filthy blues. What do you think, by the way, Al? I've heard... I mean, admittedly, this is coming from my mate who's a Rangers fan. Um, <laughs> so, take it, you know, with a pinch of salt. But he reckons this is like... This coming season is... Um, is like Rangers' best chance in a very long time of winning a... Um, of winning the league. Because, you know, Gerard's going to save them and... Um, and they've got Lennon now, haven't they? But they still won't. No, they, <laughs> I know, I know. It would, it would require some mammoth blow up from Celtic. That started well. I was all, I was first almost the entire time, but when I dodged the blue shell, everyone passed. Start with no armor and a crappy shield, and your stat distribution is terrible for any build. Oh, lovely. But is it bad for? The strength build. In fact, actually, if I was playing, um, if I was playing DS One, I don't think I'd do the strength build. I'd do the dex build. I'd be a dex scrub. That rainbow where we just played is the only one I can't, I don't despise because I've learned how to drift through it. Yeah, I think that is probably the better of of all the rainbow roads. Love retro games. I want to play the old Zeldas and Mario's. Honestly, I haven't played Tetris a lot, and I'm not that good. But I would play it for funsies. Yeah, see, I mean, like, yeah, you, like, and I, I, I've got a feeling that they're gonna start releasing some SNES games on there as well. Um, I don't know. I like, so it's worth it for the Tetris and for the online, for the NES games, and for being able to play um, Tetris with your mates. Uh, oh, sorry, Mario Kart. Even got Tetris in the brain. Um, like, I don't actually play Smash or. Although, actually, I, I don't play Smash, but my daughter does sometimes play Splatoon. And I think you need the internet for that, I think. Um, and I'm pretty sure you're going to need the internet for Mario Maker 2, and I'm going to be picking that bad boy up. So. Come on. Give me something good. Ow! Unlucky. No! Don't be getting me. Okay. It's gone past me. Do, 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 do. If you ever do stream DS, I hope you don't mind doing a bit of co op or PvP, I believe. I've never played with you. Oh, yeah, yeah. To, like, the thing is, like, now especially, like, if I was to play a Dark Souls now, it wouldn't be. Like, there's, a, there's an element of, like, if it's your first playthrough. Where it's, it's kind of like there's a bit of you that's kind of like I want the kudos of being able to say I did it myself, but I've already got that kudos. Like I've, I've already done it myself now, so I don't need the I don't need the dragon rights anymore. So I can happily just there's Diego smashing it. No, don't run into the ice. I've got some fireballs coming from mate. <laughs> oh no! How did I, oh my god? How did they everyone dodge all those? That's outrageous. I just launched a proper barrage. Um, oh man, I was doing so well about 30 seconds ago. Oh, come on! Come on, there we go. Oh, unlucky out! Enjoy your banana! Sorry, <laughs> just stealing people's mushrooms. From a teammate of as well, I think. Oh, come on, here we go. Here we go. And the last one. Come on. No, oh, I hit the ramp. Ah, <laughs> oh, that little ramp bump allowed Al to sneak in. Want to buy it on PlayStation, but I'm curious about the Switch version, so I'd buy both versions if I had the extra money. That is a rumor. Codes, are, yeah. Apparently the codes are in the system. Yeah, boy. Team Red, killing it. 
A bit of a shame you can't play with friends on Super Mario Maker 2. Yeah, that is a bit of a shame. I mean, you can still play online and like, the thing is, everyone's making out like, like I, I, I totally get that it's a bit annoying, but everyone's making out like it's like, oh my God, you can't play like, like, I don't know. Like, I think it would be a major big deal if you couldn't play with friends for like Smash Bros, because that's a multiplayer game. Or Splatoon, because that's a multiplayer game. Or Mario Kart, because that's a multiplayer game. But people are making out like Mario Maker is a multiplayer game. It's not. It, like, it wasn't a multiplayer game in the first se first game. And up until about a month ago, no one even knew that there was a multiplayer. Like, and Mario just isn't really a multiplayer game. I know there's been a couple of them over the years, but like 90% of Mario games are one-player games. I don't know, I just don't see it as that. Like, it's a bit annoying, but it's not half as big a deal as it would be if they said... Like, like it's crazy that you can't play with friends on Mario Party. Like, that's crazy. Because that's a multiplayer game. That's, that, that is like the definition of a game that you want to play with your mates. Um, Mario, that's exactly what Mario Party is. <laughs> so that you can play mini games with your mates. So it's crazy that they didn't include multiplayer on that with friends. Um, but yeah, Mario Maker, I, I'm kind of mildly disappointed, but I can live with it. I'm going to enjoy being in first place while I can, because it won't last long. Yep. <laughs> Couldn't even get me sentence out and it had it gone. No! Oh. Ah, that must be like a red shell from my own teammate. Because the thing, things like that are set up to automatically kind of not hurt your own teammates. Which is pretty sweet. Ba -dum -bum -bum. I don't know. If, do I need a mushroom to use that shortcut? I reckon I must do because it's across grass. I don't fancy risking it. Not when I'm already killing it. Look at these power slides for days. Oh, no. Ah! Oh, no. No, Al, what are you doing to me? Red shell. Have a banana. I can't, I can't get too close to him. He's going to stream snipe me. This is <laughs> intense. Now I messed up. <laughs> um, so intense that I've totally forgot what I was talking about. Um, but yeah, Mario Maker 2, I'm excited for. Come on. Let's get Team Red 1 and 2. Oh no! A blue shell is coming our way. Sorry, Valentine. Looks like I'm going to swoop the win. Yes. The first win. First win of the night. Um, yeah. So anyway, my point was, Ace, that, yeah, like, because I've played it a couple of times already, I'd be totally up for co-op and PvP and just messing around on it, because why not? Uh, do do Actually, you did stream DS3 once or twice, but you were playing the PC version, and I only have the PC PS4 version. Yeah, but didn't you help me? You helped me with the... Um, I remember you helped me with the Blood Starved Beast on Bloodborne, because, like, it's so weird. Now, if I if I go and fight the Blood, Blood Starved Beast now, I'm just, like, smash it, like, easy. Like, and the, the back then, I was just, like, I just couldn't beat him. Um... Right, I'm going to switch back to no teams, just because there's loads of us now, and just see what happens. Every man and woman for himself now. <laughs> Damn that gold bitch. <laughs> Morris out of blood, we're on the same team. Out for blood. <laughs> um, That's for the banana. Cheers, out. Oof! In Yu-Gi-Oh, there's a spell card called Hinatama, which means fireball in Japanese, but the Japanese version is called Fireboru. Fireball? Okay. Not a big, uh... I don't think I've ever played a Yu-Gi-Oh game. I saw a little bit of it on TV. Do you, did you play as any light characters? Um, I occasionally play as Mario. Just, just 
when I'm feeling like super, super lazy and I turn it on and the cursor's just on Mario automatically and I just bash the A button and just like take the default character, car, tires, everything. Um, but yeah, and I play as Link a lot. I don't even, is Link medium? I don't even know what Link is. He can't be heavy, surely not. Oh yeah, yeah, like Ninja, you can you can still create a level and you can still tell it to your friends. You can still give the code to your friends and then everyone can play it. That's Oh, Link is a heavy character. Wow, I did not know that. He's a pretty slim guy. I mean, he's he's no Bowser, is he? He's not a chunky monkey. I guess he's quite tall. Um <laughs> I didn't know he was heavy. You learn something new every day. Um, yeah, don't forget, peeps. It's everyone for themselves now, so there's no team red, no team blue. So it's going to be absolute mayhem again. Um, oh, that is a good point. Yeah, Josh, Josie, even, after this game, after this Grand Prix, rather, we'll do some battles. So let me know what people want to do now so that kind of when we finish the Grand Prix we're ready to go do you want to do like we usually do the prison one or shine thief but I'm um, you know I don't mind if we want to do something else damn yo man this ain't going well if his knees show he's a heavy character um yeah so uh, yeah, I did think about, it. and also, I'm thinking it was a, it was a uh, bit of a wild idea. <laughs> it's not that wild, <laughs> but I'm thinking that I'm going to drive off the edge. Got to go, ready for work now, Scouse. Be, being cool here. See you later, man. Have a good one. Have a good one, Ninja. Enjoy your day. Cheers, for popping in, and I hope I will see you again soon. Look at this. We're gonna kill it. Yeah, see you later, Ninja. Have a good one. Um. Ah! I love F-Zero. Oh, yes. Come on. Here we go. Oh, no! <laughs> like, literally pinballing all over the track. Come on. I've got a star and I'm not faster than anyone. It <laughs> doesn't make any sense. Sorry, I think I just stole your mushroom out. And it did not even help me get past him. Oh no. I would have nabbed it off it. Al, but he also had a star. You helped with that boss, but I barely attacked. Mostly just shot at it and threw rocks to distract it so that you could get those free hits in. Yeah, that is the... I mean, that's half the battle, isn't it? With um, Dark Souls and Bloodborne and stuff. Just, like, having the boss not having its full focus on you or whatever. He's way taller than the other characters. Yeah, that is a fair point. <laughs> Skinny, though. Eat a banana on stream. I'm gonna have to. Uh, there'll be a. There'll have to be a mega donation <laughs> before I even consider doing that. Like, honestly, if someone said to me, "I'll donate twenty dollars right now if you eat a banana," I would, in a heartbeat, say no. You're gonna have to bring out the big guns to get me to go anywhere near a banana. <laughs> Two points, two epic points. Who's Valentine's winner, and then it's Might, and then who's next? It's Marlon. Ah, uh, <laughs> Claudio's got it. He's got his iron boots in his pocket. No wonder he's heavy. Pulling it quits. No worries, Morris. I'll see you later, man. Have a good night. Disappointing England result. See you later, man. Bum, ba, dum, bum, bum, bum. I can't help. I like. I'm a. I'm a heavy character, and I think I'm a pretty fast car. And yet, I can't help but feel that on straight, on on like on the straights, I'm just not as fast as anyone else. 
Maybe it's just in my head. Nowadays, I don't need help with any boss, but I still summon for the sake of summoning. I like to troll bosses. Well, yeah, I mean, I get, it gets to the point where it's like, um, the game's, like, easy. Like, it's going to be easy if you summon and it's easy if you don't. So you might as well just have a laugh. Um, oh, yeah, so my idea was, because I know, obviously, people have been wanting, there's a couple of um, bosses people have been wanting me to do. Um, namely, Fume Knight and the Nameless King. And I thought, well, why don't... I, I was going to do a video. I've mentioned this a bunch of times that I was going to do a video. And then I thought, well, why don't I just um, stream them? Because that would be fun. <laughs> um, um, it really would. Um, and I thought, yeah, so I, I was thinking about doing that. Um, and then, you know, it's only like... I've got them both on PS4 and it will all be linked up and whatever, so... It, it, the only like hiccup or whatever would just be literally that I'd have to fight Nameless King and then halfway through just go and switch the disc but that's not a big deal um, double weapon please something good oh oh yeah <laughs> snatched a few places at the end DS Wario stage is that what you're going for which one's worst, a banana or a moth? Um. Well, I don't want to eat a moth, <laughs> but <laughs> eating aside, definitely a banana. Um. Second ape savage. I know it's brutal how fast you can fly down in this. Um. Yeah, like I'd rather have a moth on my head. Well. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think I'd rather have a moth on my hand than a banana. I don't know, like, yeah, bananas are worse. Nowadays, I don't really need health, yeah. You're going to stream them? Yes. Yes, <laughs> that is the plan. Um, hello, everyone, just here for a minute on my break at work. No worries, Andrew, how's it going, man? How's it going? you got your monster, monster to keep you, to get you through your, through the day. Yes, Hyrule Circuit, a little bit of Hyrule. What Donkey Kong would be ashamed of you, Scouse? <laughs> Not even banana and desserts? No, I, I, there's something I just... I, I don't even know what it is. There's just something about bananas that... Toad in the Yoshi bike. Right, let's go. Bananas are full of potassium. Moths love lamp. <laughs> they too love lamp. Well, that's the thing. You can't have a... Don't want to have too many bananas, or you'll die. I mean, granted, you'd have to eat, like, well, I don't even know what it is, like, 10 in one sitting or something. Probably 20. But, you know, you got to watch out for them bananas. Glorious. <laughs> -da -da -da. Come on. Yes. Give me that sweet, sweet shortcut. But didn't really gain me any time on anyone. I don't know why. Oh no! Chuck a banana at someone! <laughs> oh, I think Donkey Kong. Whoever's Donkey Kong, did you just go into a banana? Because that was definitely mine. What's it gonna be called? Killer My Rage? If, yeah, I was gonna steal your idea. So, um, but yeah, it'll be something like that, I'm sure. Um, so yeah, the, the only thing, unless I'm wrong, I think it's I think it'd just be Nameless King and Fu Knight, I think. Are the only ones to do. Um, like they're the only ones that I backed out of. On, on, like from the videos or whatever. Yoink! How do you like some of that? Um. I well, I guess I got assistance for Soul of Cinder, but I can't do him on stream because I've already killed him. Um. Ah oh, no! I got stream sniped or stream bananas. Bum bum ba da bum ba da bum ba da bum. So it's not long till E3 now. What's everyone excited to see? 
speaking of excited to see, who, am I the only one who just thinks, well, I know I'm not the only one. Damn. Damn it, no! No! I totally flew and something fell off the, something fell off the shelf and that just completely destroyed me. Um, yeah, I, can't, I know I'm not the only one because I know I've already spoke to a couple of people who agree with me. Um, um, yeah, Death Stranding? Who? I don't get this excitement over Death Stranding. Um, it's like, I don't, I don't know, I, I, like, I'm literally, I'm speechless, because <laughs> I just, I just, I don't know, like, I can, I can understand, I could understand seeing that and being like, oh, I'm intrigued. But there are people who are like, oh my god, this is going to be like, game of the year. And it's like, what? Game of the year? I don't even know what type of game it is. Like, I literally, I, I know absolutely nothing about it. It can't, you can't say it's game of the year when you don't know anything about it. Um, I can totally understand why someone would see it and be like, oh, I want to see more. But you can't go throwing around stuff like game of the year. I'm excited, yeah, I'm excited for From's new game. And yeah, same, same here, Andrew. I want to see, um, oh, I definitely want to see some Link's Awakening. And, I mean, this is a long shot, but it would be amazing if they were like, hey, and we're making a second, like, proper, like, you know, I'll call it Breath of the Wild 2, but they're not going to, obviously they wouldn't call it that, but, you know, a second proper brand new Zelda game. If they, I don't expect to see footage of it, but even if they just announced that they were going to do it, Mm. That'd be pretty cool. But yeah, I want to see some Link's Awakening. Um, and I obviously want to see some um, Final Fantasy VII Remake. That would be amazing. <laughs> I mean, I was so like... That that trailer that we got recently, it just looks so good. I love the look of the characters. Um, and the, the only other thing is that now that Shenmue 3 has been delayed, I can only assume... The, the delay means that there's probably more chance that... Oh, come on! I got whacked <laughs> off the edge. Um, I can only assume that the fact that they've delayed Shenmue 3... Like, cause it was supposed to come out in August. And if it had been due to come out in August and, you know, the E3's in June, then they might have thought, well, there's no point showing anything because it's like, you'll see the full game soon. But now it's going to be ages till we see the full game, so they might kind of show us some more. I would love to see some more gameplay, really. <laughs> like, we haven't seen a whole ton of gameplay, to be honest. Um, which, okay, it's not, I don't know, it's not the end of the world, because, you know, I'm going to buy it no matter, well, I say I'm going to buy it no matter what, I've already got it pre-ordered, so... Like, I'm playing it no matter what, but I'd still like to see a little bit, I guess. I mean, although I'm not one of these one people who wants everything, like, spoiled to death. And, like, wants to see, every like, tons of everything. Like, I'm quite happy to have a nice surprise when I just turn the game on and just see something for the first time ever. Boom! That is a win, peeps. Um... Literally, the Kojima effect. Yeah, but I, I think maybe that's part of the reason why I have less interest. Because I haven't... Like, Kojima's just pretty much Metal Gear Solid, right? And apart from the very first Metal Gear Solid, I haven't played a Metal Gear Solid game ever. Um, so, I guess that's why I'm not that excited. <laughs> that was pretty close, apart from the fact that um, Marlon absolutely crushed it. Uh, so there isn't any info at all, and people are hyped already. No, it's yeah, like there is a um, there was a I think like a ten minute there was a ten minute trailer hyper. I think it was about maybe it was less than ten minutes, maybe eight minutes or something. Um, and Shemu has gameplay. <laughs> How dare you? Um, you mean any gameplay? <laughs> yeah. Um, 
Yeah, so it was like an eight minute, um, you know. Oh, yeah, sorry. We we're going to do, no, we're going to do some mini games, aren't we? Um, okay, so what are we doing? Renegade Roundup, Bombs, Coin Runners, Giant Thief. Get your picks in. Gonna head off, folks. All right, no worries. I'll see you later. See you later. Good night, Al. Good night, Lisa. Um, Shine. So we've got one vote for Shine. If no one else says anything, we're going with Shine. There we go. Two people said Shine. I'm happy. <laughs> Two's good enough for me. Liking the announcement of the Hyperkin N64 clone console that was that has HDMI output. Oh, I saw something about that, but then I saw someone complaining, saying, like, it just... They, they were saying something that I didn't even understand, to be honest. They said... It was on Twitter, and they said something like, it turns out that it doesn't... It, like, rips the ROM from the cartridge instead of reading it or something. I don't know. They, they had some complaint about how it actually runs the game. I, I, I didn't really know. It's a Hideo Kojima game that alone assure, ensures people will be hyped and buy it. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, Hyper. So, yeah, it was like an eight-minute video, something like that, trailer. And I'm not joking. Seven and a half minutes of it were, like, cutscene um, stuff. There was, like, 30 seconds of gameplay, and it was, like... It, and it was, like, the least, like, I don't know... In, like, the least... I don't know, but it, like... It didn't show anything, basically. It would, it, it would be like saying, Hey, here's some footage. This is what this is what Breath of the Wild looks like. And then just showing someone running through a green field for 10 seconds. Like, the very, very small bit of gameplay that they showed was just him basically running around the open world. Like, <laughs> it was... I don't know, like... I guess it was semi-normal, the, the kind of thing that you might expect from a very early trailer. But, and that's fine. But when you get something like that, you don't, it, it, you wouldn't expect people to say, oh, this is, you know, this is game of the year 2019. Before, you know, before you've really seen the game. Come on. There we go. Oh my God, how did I miss so often? Oh, set it, set him up, set Diego up a treat there. Oh, I can't get my hands on the star. No, that's a bomb in the face. Leaves, he wants a feather, he wants a feather. Feathers must be like the least useful item ever. Bum, 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 bum. Yes. Come on, I've got to have it for at least a second. <laughs> Is that too much to ask? Fireball! And whatever new system Skyrim's coming to? Are you talking about you want to see... I'm going to have to read that in a second. <laughs> Are you saying that you basically want to see, like, the next Elder Scrolls? I would like to see an Elder Scrolls that isn't online. To be honest, I'm not, a, like, as a general rule, I just don't like online games that much. Um, I'm, I, I like to just play my games on my own. <laughs> just, I mean, I know that sounds silly when I'm playing this. This this is the kind of game that, you know, you should play with friends. But when it comes to, like, you know, one player, you know, like, one player RPGs, like, I don't know, Horizon Zero Dawn or Zelda or Dark Souls. I like, you know, I just want to play it on my own. I don't want to be forced to have to do all stuff online with people. Du -du -du. Played nearly every Metal Gear up to five. They're all amazing games with great stories and tight gameplay. Really? I thought that... Or was it maybe maybe you haven't played five? Is it five? The one... I heard that five got absolutely, like, ripped apart by critics, because... I mean, obviously, they're exaggerating, but... Um, I've heard that, you know, like, oh, again, it, obviously it's an exaggeration, but I've heard like 75% of Meg Metal Gear Solid 5 is cutscenes. It's like, it's supposed to be like worse than, worse than Final Fantasy 10. It's just like cutscene, 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 like 10, like constant, like, 
10 minute long cutscenes and stuff. To, uh, like, is what I heard anyway. Um, I think that was five. Five's like a movie you barely play. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'd heard. Um, and as much as I like Shenmue, which, you know, is arguably similar. Mike, Mike's about to come off a ledge. Ba -ba -da -bum -bum -ba -da. Um, there's still a decent amount of gameplay in Shenmue. I'm not having anyone saying there isn't. Oh, just trying to wait for him. Da -da 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 Might's too good. Might's too good. No, second away. Done. I'd love to see Elder Scrolls 6, but it's more likely they're porting Skyrim to my fridge next. <laughs> when are When you gonna play as Gold Mario? I was, and then I realized that um you can only play one, you can only play online if you have like like the the online Do I need to add anyone as a friend by the way? I don't I haven't checked for a while. Um, you can only add, no, it's all good. You can only add someone, sorry, I, the only account on this Switch that can play online is the Scouse account. Like the other, the, the, the online is linked to my name. So if I was Leah, I wouldn't be able to play online. Um, so sadly I can't steal her golden Mario. They said that Death Stranding is not a walking simulator. <laughs> That's good to know. Um. Yeah, okay. Dark Souls, I, I can totally understand people saying Dark Souls Online is amazing. But, like, at least Dark Souls Online is, like, an optional feature of the game. It's not like... It's not like you have to play online or you can't complete the game. Um... I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, that's not what I'm all about. Green chill! Come on, come on! Might! <laughs> Either Might's the best dodger in the world, or I'm the worst shot ever. I think it's probably the latter. I'll have that. Oh, it went over the barrier! Bum, ba, dum, ba. Oh no! The star bounced over the barrier, or the shine. This gameplay in Shenmue walks from one to cut to into the next. Oh god, there it is. Oh, look at them U-turn skills. Yeah, it's long gone. Might as well just get myself a weapon. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Right, this is like as good as it gets. Doesn't get much better than this for a weapon. Coming for you, mate. Not having you hiding on a wall. Ooh, no! I, can't, I just can't get it. It's outrageous. I just can't get my hands on that shine. Um, yeah, so I want to see some Shenmue 3. I want to see some Final Fantasy 7 Remake. I want to see what FromSoft's new game is. I want to see some Link's Awakening. Um, I think that's pretty much me done. I think if I, if I see that, I'll be happy. I'm just gonna hang around and wait for someone else to whack him and then try and scoop it up. Or not. This is disaster. I've literally... How many games have we had now? I think this is the third round and I have held the shine for a combined total of zero seconds. Love the online because eventually you reach a point where the areas and the bosses are pretty easy and repetitive, but online is always a different experience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, that's what I mean. Like, I, I like, I took, like, I, I like that part of Dark Souls, but I wouldn't like it if, like, imagine if they said in Dark Souls, like, you have to co-op every boss, and. You could never play online. Uh, sorry, you could never play offline on your own ever again. I think that would be less good. Ban might. <laughs> it's too good. I don't know. Diego's doing pretty damn good. Oh yeah, I love to see Prime Four. Yeah, because they um, 
cancelled that last time, didn't they? Oh, oh, well, they basically said they were going back to the beginning. <laughs> Can't get the shine, I know. I just want it for a second. I'm not asking for much. I'm not asking for a win. Coming for you, Aiden. Do, 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 do. Do, do. Come on. We're all chasing him. There's like a crazy pack of us right behind him. And yes! No! Oh, Josie. Josie. Where's it gone? Oh, seriously. <laughs> Give me the shine. Breaks over. See everyone tomorrow. No worries. And oh, that reminds me. Andrew, um, I think you were actually. Um... Oh, no! Um, basically, I'm going to be streaming. Um, I know you um, said you were going to send it, but I realized that. Um, We've, I've already got um, yes and I've got a star so you can't take it off me peeps yes <laughs> I'm going to enjoy this I'm going to have that as my little protection ba -da -ba -da yeah so um, I'm going to be playing Bioshock 1 tomorrow is, is the short version of what I'm trying to say um I realized, or rather Emma realized, that we already had the first one. Um, so if you did still want to, you know, obviously there's no obligation, but if you still wanted to, um, you know, gift that to me, um, then two is the only one that I don't have. Just so you know. Like, I don't want you wasting money on buying me a game that I've already got. We did address that way back when the first DS was released. Online was a core part of the game. Really? Um. Oh, hang on. There's no way I'm going to read that. And I can barely get the shine when I'm actually paying attention. Right, come on. I've got like the ultimate weapon now. I've just got to get near him. Come on. We're going to cut him off. Oh, he's right behind me. Oh, where is he? Come on. Where? Oh my god, I wish I knew this map. Where on earth is he? I bet he's hiding somewhere. He's like hiding in a corner. Come on. And he can see my stream, so... <laughs> there he is! Yes! At the last... What? I took it off him! I loud speak at him. Um, online was a core part of the game. They didn't want to make a game where you need constant connection, so they added offline. Okay. Hey, Steve, how's it going? Um, I wasn't gonna buy it just because, as you say, um, I don't have fond memories of it. Not, not that I have unfond memories of it. Um. But I never had a PlayStation 1 growing up. Um. <laughs> Might was just a beast. He, he did, he pipped it in the last game though. Diego went into the, um, went into the last one winning. Right, let's do a, let's do some uh, Renegade Roundup. And then we can do another Grand Prix. I found him with the, oh, that's annoying. Can we go back? Oh, no, I can't. Are you sure you want to go back? No, I'm not sure. Fine, it's just going to be uneven teams. Um, although we have got Might on our side. The unstoppable Might. Oh, sorry, Josie. I've just missed out. I, just, I read that, like... Or you typed it, like, two seconds after I selected the teams. So, I literally couldn't have even done it. Um. Oh, yeah, that's what I was saying, Steve. So, um, yeah, I didn't have a PlayStation 1, so I have never played... Well, I've like growing up I've having since grown up I've played like a tiny bit of the first Crash Bandicoot but I haven't really ever played Crash Bandicoot any of the Crash Bandicoot games and I haven't played the Crash the Crash Racing game at all like the original or anything um so um 
Yeah, so I, have, I haven't got any, like, fond memories of that at all. Um, Offline was more of an anti-frustration feature so that you can still play without internet, but they decided to keep it. Yeah, I mean, I, well, yeah, it's good if you haven't got internet, and it's, like, I know that a lot of people do it, um, specifically to avoid invasions. I have, I have played Diddy Kong Grayson. It was amazing. Um, I, like, that might have, I might have even preferred that over, like, Mario Kart 64. I just, it had this, if I remember rightly, it had, like, this really cool, um, like, one-player campaign with, like, proper missions and stuff. Um, that, that game was so, so good. Like, I remember kind of, um... I got it as a kid, but I still kind of, as I, as I got it, I kind of remember thinking, I bet you this is just like a cheap, a cheap rip off. I bet you this is just like, you know, an excuse to try and make more money and, you know, it's going to be rubbish. Um, you know, it'll just be a poor man's Mario Kart, but, um, it, no, it was like totally its own thing and it was, it was so good. Right, I'm gonna hang out. Damn, I was just gonna say I'm gonna hang out by the prison cell. And as I did, um, or as I was heading that way, they escaped. Hello, cat again. Cheeky, man, great. Oh, what? No! Diego! What are you doing? Get him. Right, no, no. Oof. Never gonna get him now. He's long gone. Um. Yeah, I'd love to play some more of that. Aiden. Oh, Aiden's the one with the uh, gold Mario. Come on. I just can't catch him. Where's he gone now? I have completely lost him. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, what? How did I not eat Diego? Bum, ba, dum, bum, bum, bum. Oh, so hot. I've still got to play the original. I really want to get hurry up and play the original Link's Awakening. Um, so I can get it played before the new one comes out. There we go. We've got Aiden and someone else. I'm sure I got someone else. No, I didn't. It's just this one. Ooh. Ah, Diego's too good. He's always on the... Uh... He's always there. Even when I'm supposed to be guarding it, he just swoops straight in. Ba -da -ba. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I missed Aiden there. Oh, we got battered. Peeps, we got battered. Oh, actually, we did get... You do get points just for catching them, don't you? Even if they escape. Hello, Dylan. How's it going? So hard to be a cop in this game. <laughs> I know. It, it feels that way. Um, Luigi's Mansion, that's a pretty good one to kind of hide. Sekiro was amazing, not gonna lie, but the lack of online and builds means it's something I only play enough to get all the endings and then never again. Yeah, see, like, I, I've heard people say that, but um, my argument is... You know, like, people say, like, oh, I don't want to play it again because I can't do a different build. But when I played Dark Souls, you know, like, when I've played Dark Souls, I've played Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3 twice each. And with all of them, I pretty much did the same build both times. Like, it didn't bother me that I was, like, <laughs> I don't know, it didn't, like, I had the option to do different builds and I still didn't take the option. Um... Oh! God, I 
I just saw two of them come towards me. Um. So yeah, I think I think I'd play it again. I I play it again just if only to see how good I am now. If you know what I mean, like. Like, because I've started, uh, I started, I said this recently that, um, that I started the second save game not that long ago, just to, to mess around on, because there's times where I want to play Sekiro, but I haven't, I can't record, so, but I still want to play the game, but I can't record, um, and so I just started the brand new save game and just thought I'll mess around with this, and it's just crazy how, like, it, the difference, like, I can just kill bosses first go. I mean, it's, it's exactly the same with Dark Souls and Bloodborne and all of them. Kind of, once you know the tactics, it just makes such a difference. Look at this, by the way. I have not been caught once. Oh! <laughs> How's that for timing? Bragging about not being caught once and get nabbed. Should have moved me to your team. Well, I was being I was being nice by uh, leaving me with the three man team. Yes, good work, mate. I'm convinced this is the music from. Um... Do you know on? Um... Has anyone played We Fit? I played that quite a lot. You know, with the balance board, and um, there was one of the like mini games was was you like standing on the balance board doing kung fu, and I'm, and they and they they like do a move and go, huh, huh. <laughs> and I'm convinced that that is this. I don't know if any of them have noticed yet that I'm literally just doing circles around the main lobby. I mean, obviously, they're going to notice now. I've <laughs> just said it on the stream. But I'm still going to keep doing it. Got to catch me first. Oh! I, th <laughs> I thought someone was coming towards me there, so I aborted. Oh! Come on, killing it! I'm going to have gone the whole thing and only got caught once. Aiden's caught might. Yes! Got the win for the team. Also, when this trigger bird, I wouldn't mind if their new game slows down. Bloodborne and Sekiro made it faster than ever, but I also like the slowness. Oh yeah, totally. Like I the thing is I like both. Um so Yeah, if if they go back to Dark Souls 1 speed, I'd be happy if they stick with, you know. Secure, I'd be happy. Um, I don't know. It's so hard. Like, I, clearly, they just are better at making games than I am. Um, which is not a surprise, is it really? Um, but um, yeah. So we'll have one. La we'll have one last Grand Prix after this battle, and then I think I'm gonna wrap up for the night. Um, get some sleepies because we're just doing a short stream tonight, and then tomorrow we're gonna do a big chunky stream of Bioshock. First time ever playing it. Uh, we got the remaster, and we're just going to jump in. I've seen the first, like, 30 seconds of it, um, just to test that it worked and whatever. But, yeah, it's going to be a totally blind playthrough of Bioshock. Can't wait. I've not even seen videos of it. Shame on me. Of Dark Souls. Claudio. I mean, if you love... If you can handle, like, you know, hard, punishing games, which... You clearly can, because um, your favourite game is Mega Man, which <laughs> like is the definition of hard and punishing. Um, oh, just let one get past me. Um, yeah, I'm sure you can. If you can handle Mega Man, then you can handle Dark Souls. It's just, I think the only thing that stops people beating Dark Souls is they don't realise that it's supposed to be a learning process. If you don't know what I mean, like you're not supposed to just win fair. You know, you're not supposed to beat bosses first time. Um, like, it, you know, that's not the way it's supposed to go. It doesn't matter if you're, like, I don't know, like, sometimes, like, 
say you're like really good at platforming games, you might go into Celeste and just smash it because you're really good at platforming games. It doesn't matter how good you are at other games, you will not beat. Dark, you know, you will not just walk in and be really good at Dark Souls instantly without having played one of those games before. It's just, it won't happen. Um, so yeah, uh, like if you just if people just accept it's a learning, <laughs> it's a learning curve, then. I really don't think it's that hard. Um, mostly. Um, okay, which games am I looking to buy next on the Switch? Have you played any of the Splinter Cell games? Love the first three. I remember playing them on the GameCube. Um, I played Splinter Cell. In fact, I've still got it. I played the first Splinter Cell on PS2, I think it was. It was on PS2, right? Um... Yeah, so I played the first one on PS2, and I haven't played any of the other ones, although I am pretty rubbish at games that involve stealth. Um, I'm just, like, whether it's Assassin's Creed or Hitman or Splinter Cell, Metal Gear Solid, I'm just so bad at stealth. Um, and, um, right, let's... Oh, hello! Oh, what? He got past me! That is outrageous. How did he get past me there? I don't know, but I've got Josie already. Oh, and Aiden's back. Come on. Have another bash. Oh, what? Okay, okay I've got Katakin. Right, there's one left. Okay. Come on, we can do this. Diego was lurking. He was lurking. Um, gotta wake up early in the morning to lurk past me. <laughs> Oh yeah, so games I'm looking to buy for next on the Switch, definitely Mario Maker 2 and Link's Awakening. They're the ones I'm most... Um, they're like they're like sets. They're definite buys. Um, I'll be honest, I'm not that hyped about Pokemon. Um, just because it's a bit... I, I find like... Um, Pokemon's a bit overwhelming now, because there's like, you know, 8 million Pokemon, and like, it's just so... I don't know, like, and I don't know any of them anymore. Like, when it was Pokemon Red, I knew them all. I knew the weaknesses and all the strengths and what was good against what. Now, I don't know any... I just don't know any of the names. I don't know what's good, what's strong. Um, is the Dark Souls and Switch a good starting point, then? Don't worry about boss difficulty. I love that. It's, it's like Monster Hunter Curve. Um, yes, I like Dark Souls on the um, Switch is... The remaster, I, you know, that's as good a place as any. I, in fact, I would say start. There's only three Dark Souls games, um, and by the way, only one of them is on the Switch. Um, ah, oh, whoa, what? <laughs> that was gonna be the quickest game ever. Oh my god. Well, that was short and sweet. Bump, bump. and it's two all. I feel like that's a, w a win for the Reds, considering it's two all and we had less people. Oi, oi. Win for the Reds. <laughs> Already pre-ordered Iceborne? What's Iceborne? Is that like a... Um... Is that like DLC for Monster Hunter or something? Claudio's got good tasting games. Alright, let's have another Grand Prix. Let's have something nice. Ah, DLC, I thought so. Um. Bum, bum, ba, dun, dun. Right, we still haven't had my Toad's turn, Pike. Love that, love that course. Um. Yeah, Dark Souls. Yeah, so, oh, it's so good. Um. There's so many different ways. I mean, oh, I, I, it's so good. Like, I'd never even heard of it until I started. Until I started YouTube, I'd never heard of the series at all. And someone said, trying to be kind of all funny. Uh, well, well, they weren't trying to be funny. I don't mean it in a bad way. Um, they, they just, like, they said, oh, why don't you try and beat this particular boss that's in Dark Souls? Because it's, like, famously a really hard boss. And I was like, oh, all right, fair enough. Like... Never heard of the game, like, but I'm pretty good at games. How hard can it be? Um, so I I played, so I I just started playing Dark Souls purely on the basis that um, 
I was going to try and beat this particular boss. And, um, and then I love Dark Souls 1. And then I just I jumped straight into 2. Because I've done blind playthroughs of them all on the channel. Um, so as I say, like, I never even heard of them about two years ago when I hadn't started the channel. And then I did the blind playthrough of 1. Loved it. So I, I literally started a blind playthrough of 2 straight after it. Loved that. And then literally started the blind playthrough of Dark Souls 3 straight after that. And then a blind playthrough of Bloodborne, which is basically... It's made by the same people, and it's essentially the same game, but instead of, like... Instead of, like... The, it, instead of the setting being kind of, like, knights and dragons and wizards and that kind of thing, it's more, like, vampires and wolves and, you know, like, Lovecraftian, is that the word? Um... Yeah, so it's it's made by the same people. It's essentially a, a very similar game, just in a different setting. Um, but yeah, and they're all amazing. Like, I can't, like, it's so rare that I find a game that I would say is 10 out of 10. And every single one of the games in that series, I think, is 10 out of 10. Um, like, before that, I, I honestly, I, I don't think, I don't think I've played one game as an adult that I think is 10 out of 10, apart from those. Like, ev every single game that I think is 10 out of 10 are all from my childhood. Um, and there's probably an element of nostalgia thrown in there, but I can't remember the last time I've played a, a brand new game as an adult and thought, oh my god, that is, like, amazing. Um, apart from those games. Um, actually, no, 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 okay, I tell a lie. Cuphead and Hollow Knight. Cuphead and Hollow Knight are, like amazing as well. Um, you should totally give Monster Hunter a try scouts like Dark Souls, but only the bosses. <laughs> really? Well, I'll, I'll definitely give it a go then. Because my favourite bit of Dark Souls is the bosses. Top 5 favourite games ever. Um, Final Fantasy 7. I'm not going to put them in order because it's hard and it changes from one time to the next. Um, but in the top 5 is definitely Final Fantasy 7. Definitely Shenmue 1 and 2. Well, I'll group them together because it's essentially... They're just... Yeah, they, yeah. It's one game. <laughs> so Shenmue 1 and 2, definitely. Final Fantasy 7, definitely. Um, Ocarina of Time, definitely. Um, and then it gets... Uh, then then the, it's between a few. Like, it could be any of the Dark Souls games... Or Link to the Past, or Final Fantasy X, probably. They're, like they are the ones that probably make up the rest. Either Final Fantasy X, um, Link to the Past, or one of the Dark Souls slash I was Sekiro. Um, it's a boss fight game, pretty much. Speaking of boss fight games, I've got to play Fury. Bird keeps telling me to play Fury, which is just literally a boss rush. Um, what about you, Steve? What's your top five games? It's really hard to pin down five exactly, but they, they're definitely the ballpark. I know that Final Fantasy VII, Shenmue, and Ocarina of Time are definitely in the top five. And then there's a bit of a tussle over who gets the other couple of spots. Um, but yeah, what about you? What about everyone else? How many of... Uh, how many Dark Souls games, or how many FromSoft games make it into your top five, Ace, if any? I assume some do. Dark Souls 2 must do, surely. That might even be number one. I know, isn't Final Fantasy 12 one of your favorite games of all time? So maybe Final Fantasy 12, Dark Souls 2, Monster Hunter World, maybe? Um, Symphony of the Night, maybe? Come on, what's your top five, Ace? <laughs> I've just named probably five games. I might have just named Ace's top five. If they, if I've just named his top five, by the way, that that is impressive knowledge of him. <laughs> right, someone's getting some red shells. No, no one's getting any red shells. They all failed. Bum, 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 bum. Oh yeah, skipping corners with the star. Oh no! Go! Oh 
man. This is uh, <laughs> tight at the front. Come on. Yeah, what about you, Steve? What is it? What's your top five? I mean, I did write a top 50, although I haven't actually put it into order. Because um, I was thinking about, at some point, doing, like, a video. Although it would be, like, a mammoth task to do, like, a video of my top 50 games of all time. Or maybe even do it, like, I don't know, I could split it up into smaller videos, like... I don't know, do 10 per video or whatever. But yeah, to, I, I've, I, I've, ri I've written, I wrote my top 50 games. Uh, I would have to put them in order though, I guess. Bam, bam. Monster Hunter is great because of the great online community. While you can go solo, it's much more satisfying to form parties and go hunting. Okay. Because it's free on the, um, what, oh, by the way, do you guys play it on PS4 or Xbox? Um, because it's it's free on the Game Pass, so that's that, that's the kind of reason I was gonna try it. Um, because it was free. My top five hmm, in ascending order: Live a Live. Li what what's Live a Live? I've never heard of that. Live a Live. That's a weird name. <laughs> is it is your, is it Live a Life or am I just I don't know. That's the weirdest name ever. Um. Symphony of the Night, Final Fantasy XII, every from, from Soft Game and Monster Hunter. There we go. I got four out of five then. Four out of five is not bad. And I haven't even heard of the fifth one. Oh, I'm actually playing the previous version on Switch, Generation Ultimate. Oh, okay. I didn't even know it was on Switch. Everything's on Switch now, isn't it? <laughs> oh, man. It is the port machine. And everyone complains about that, but it's like, why? I don't know why you complain about it. Like, 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 you know, they can do ports and new games as well. It doesn't have to be one or the other. Like, you know, get all the ports and, and they can still do games as well. So, just be happy that there's more games on there. And I, you know, I love like the ability to play some old like you know I picked up Final Fantasy 7 on the Switch for 12 12 pound sterling um, and 12 you know 12 quid I've, I've already played it once and I'm probably well I'm in the middle of playing it a second time um, it's it's already and it's 12 quid I think come on no worries, Josie. I'll see you later, man. This is the last Grand Prix anyway, so whenever we finish this Grand Prix, we're all done. Ba -dum -bum, ba -da -ba -dum. Have a good night, Josie. I'll see you later. Yeah, so if anyone is interested in Bioshock, that's what we're going to be streaming tomorrow night. And um, I might actually go extra late tomorrow night. Um, just because... Um, Usually, I'm concerned about keeping Emma awake and stuff, um, but Emma's not going to be here tomorrow night, so I might stream a little bit later than normal as well. But yeah, we're going to be going blind into Bioshock. Yeah, Ace, I don't know if you were here, actually. I was talking earlier about games I was considering doing, um, and I was thinking about doing a blind playthrough of Skyrim. Um, it, like, I've only played the very, very start of it before. Um, and I... Ah, oh, crushed. Um, um, oh, I came last. Ooh. It's not like that. It's a SNES RPG. Very obscure. Oh, okay. <laughs> I didn't even know about it until a year ago and it's already at my top five. Wow. That must be, uh, that must be some game then. And I do love a good SNES RPG. I might have to check it out. Is it like, is it like another clone of like Final Fantasy VI and Chrono Trigger, which are just like super, super similar? Um, 
Or is it more like Secret of Mana or something? What Zelda will you play next? I'm not sure. Um, I would like... To, I'm either going to play... Um, I'm going to play Link's Awakening, the, the, the HD remaster, as soon as that comes out. But that's not going to be coming out. The rumours are it's not going to be coming out until about December. So, that's probably not going to be the next one. Um, I want to play Skyward Sword, because that is the only console Zelda that I haven't played before. Um, and it's the, well, it's the only one that I haven't played on the channel. Um, I've done all the other ones now. Um, and I want to play some of the... Um, some of the handheld ones like Spirit Tracks, uh, Phantom Hourglass, Minish Cap, and Link Between Worlds. I haven't played any other handheld ones, and they're all. I've I've heard pretty good things about every single handheld Zelda game, and I haven't played any of them. So definitely up for a bit of that. Um, what a shortcut that was. <laughs> Um, yeah, so I want to play some of the handheld ones. So the next one is probably going to be Skyward Sword or one of the handheld ones. Um, and then obviously Link's Awakening as soon as that comes out. Although, another thing I want to do. Um, someone suggested that I try and do a three-heart run of a Zelda game. And I was saying that basically the only, the only Zelda games that I'm good enough Um, the only the only Zelda games that I'm good enough at to even consider doing a three heart challenge are Link to the Past and Ocarina of Time. But you can't do a three heart challenge in Link to the Past because when you defeat the dungeon in Link to the Past, it forces you to pick up the heart. So there's no way around it. Where so the only one I could do a three heart challenge on would be Ocarina of Time, um, which I am pretty good at. So I'm tempted to do a three heart challenge. On um, Ocarina of Time. I mean, my biggest worry about that would probably be fighting Shadow Link in the Water Temple, because I just I've never been good at fighting Shadow Link in the in the Water Temple. Um, but yeah, if I can crack that, that might be the biggest roadblock. Um, oh yeah, so and I really love Ocarina of Time, so I would take any excuse to play the game again. Um, boom, second place. Consider how good everyone is. <laughs> Uh, like, I am definitely the noob of the crowd here, so I'm pretty happy we're getting second. Um, I was like Final Fantasy X based on all. Boop. And I play on PS4. You can go solo or let others drop in. Play pretty seamless. Are you play solo if I want to brag, multiplayer if I want fun times. Skyrim is pretty nice, it'd be the sixth on my list. Oh wow, really? That's pretty good. Good game, good game. Who's got the crown? Is that... I think that's Aiden, isn't it? I believe it is. Oof. Right, pipes. Gonna switch over to the farewell screen. That's not working. <laughs> Hello, there we are. Oh god. Dropping my controller. Um, yeah, I love Ocarina of Time. It's amazing. Um, I still. I don't think any video game will ever be better than Ocarina of Time. Period. <laughs> I, 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 you know, it's, um, it's certainly possible. Like, oh my God, Claudio just became a member. Oh my God. Thank you, Claudio. That is amazing. That is the tenth member. Whee! And there should be a little. Oh, I hope it comes up because we're on the right screen. I hope that played. Did we get the loud cheer? Ah! There it is. Oh! Claudio is the MVP. <laughs> and that takes us to ten, which means we do actually get. Uh, I've got space now for uh, YouTube will let me have another custom emoji because as as it is, by the way. Um, for any relatively new um, members, you might not realize that you have access to those custom emojis that I've just posted. And now that we've got 10 members, I'm allowed to like add another one. So I'll be doing that ready for tomorrow's stream. 
six out of ten. <laughs> Not having that. <laughs> but um each to their each to their own, I guess. I mean, I can I can understand it not being a 10 out of 10. Um, although I'd say it is, but you know, that that's opinion, I guess. Only played like two hours of Skyrim. Hate the combat. Oh, well, see, I've played about 200 hours of Oblivion. Um, and the combat's pretty much... Like, have you played Oblivion? Because the combat's pretty much um, the same. Do, do, do. Six is oh six is a good six six out of ten is like eh, it's pretty good that that's how I view a six to me like ten is like whoa groundbreaking like one of the best games of all time nine is like wow this is amazing eight is like yeah this is really solid really solid seven is yeah pretty that's a good seven's good I'd, I'd say like seven is probably where I put like Uncharted um. Six is okay. To me, it's like a good game, but may depend on your taste. Yeah. Anyway, thank you again, Claudio. So kind of you to sponsor, man. I will have to uh, give you the sponsor rank in Discord and give you all the goodies. Um, which means, by the way, you get your own... You know, like, as it is, we've got, like, um, that for Al. Call we've me got, you know, Exclamation mark, Al, Marlin, Bird. Hyper, everyone, everyone who's a sponsor gets their own. Everybody's heard own, about like, the bird message. So um, yeah, I'll, I'll get one of those recorded for you so that you can turn up and go, hello, it's Claudio. Would you rather I say Claudio or Diego? By the way, when I record it, let me know. Read my previous comment, boy. <laughs> what have you said? Claudio's the MVP. I saw that. No. Two I games I suggest for you, Scouse. Live a Live and Monster Hunter. I'm sure you'll like them. Yeah, I will definitely check out both of them. Um, I'm intrigued about this Live a Live that I've never heard of it. Hyper, how's it going? Do you know, every time, I don't know if this is... Um, um, I don't know if this is going to annoy you. It, it shouldn't annoy you. Um, but every single time I see your name, Hyper... The only thing it makes me think of is um, the the only thing it makes me think of is fighting Sagat in in Street Fighter 2 Turbo, um, where every single move he does, he goes hyper, hyper, <laughs> hyper uppercut. That's that's all I think of whenever I see your name. Little insight into my brain there. Um, top five would be Link's Awakening. I've still got to play that. I really want to play it. Link to the Past, great choice. Ocarina of Time, great choice. Celeste, great choice. I need to get back into Dark Souls after you talking about it. Oh, it is really good. Um, that is only four, though. <laughs> um, but yeah, Link to the Past, Ocarina of Time, and Celeste are amazing. And I haven't played the other one. Um, what else am I playing today? I'm not playing anything now. Um, but tomorrow I'm going to be playing Bioshock, which I've never played before. i um, really excited about that. I've got the HD remaster all lined up, ready to go. Um, so I'm going to do a nice big chunky. Apparently it's not that um, it's not that long. So it might only take, a, I don't know, three, st three streams maybe. Um, really loved watching Wind Waker. Oh yeah, Wind Waker is amazing. Um, I'm going to be doing more Zelda soon. But yeah, tomorrow is going to be Bioshock. And um, yeah, I think I'm going to do... There's going to be a stream sometime soon. Oh, Resident Evil 4. I do want to do... I wanted to do that as well. Um, I wanted to stream that because I saw that it was like available on PS Now. Um, you. <laughs> you are the single person who thinks that Ocarina of Time is meh. You are. Um... Well, I'm sure you're not. I, I like. I guess it's one of those things. Like, I think sometimes people go the other way because, like, I hear a lot of people going, "Oh, you know, Final Fantasy VII's terrible," and I think, I, I think they don't really think it's terrible, but because everyone says it's ten out of ten, like, rather than say, "Actually, no, it's just a very good game," they go the other way and go, "No, it's terrible." Like, hmm. 
Like, I, I don't know, I can't imagine anyone thinks that Final Fantasy VII is a terrible game. Unless, of course, you don't like turn-based RPGs, but then that's just, like, whatever. <laughs> but yeah, like, if you like turn-based RPGs, I cannot believe that anyone would say Final Fantasy VII is terrible. It's just, it's either the best game in the world, or it's a very good game. Wind Waker was a nice experience. I was part of the dumb people who initially rejected the game because of its graphics. I regret that so bad. Yeah, I like, I was a bit fun. Hey, Naomi's just popped on, or Sasha. Um, onto you, or it'll be, it'll be Sasha. Um, onto watching some YouTubes. Um, do, 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 do. Yeah, I, I, I was a bit funny about Wind Waker at first, but it, it didn't put me off buying it just because, um, I was a big enough Zelda fan to just be like, whatever, I'm still going to go with it. And um, it didn't take me long at all to think, actually, this looks really cool. No one else really hates it. <laughs> um, gold school tools. Oh, well, yeah, I mean, it's a collectathon, isn't it? I'm not a fan of, I'm generally not a fan of collectathons in anything. Um, Final Fantasy VIII is underrated. Yeah, I've heard it's like Final Fantasy VIII and Final Fantasy IX, by the way, are definitely coming to the channel soon. Um, although it's been recommended that I do them as videos rather than live streams, because if I do them as live streams, people are going to be constantly telling me what to do and spoil. they'll probably spoiler the whole story for me because people are like that and whatever. So I'm probably going to like do Final Fantasy VIII and IX as like a, Zelda as like a video series. Um, I'll probably start one of those as soon as I finish Sekiro. It's a really obscure RPG. If you know about it, I know you love obscure games, by the way. So there you go. <laughs> live a live. Which boss battles are my favourite ever? Oh, God. Um, that's tough. Um, I'll come back to that. Skyward Sword for best Zelda. Am I right? <laughs> I'll let you know once I've played it. Um, Twilight Princess. They're all good. Ocarina of Time. Amazing. Wind Waker, Link to the Past, Twilight Princess, everything except Majora's Mask. I'm, jo I'm, jo I'm joking, I'm joking. Majora's Mask is good. I, ju it's ju I just think it's less good than the others, but they're all good. Um, live a Live is a weird name, but what can I do? That's the name. <laughs> I know, it's even weird to say. Um, I love Bongo Bongo. <laughs> bum, ba, dum, bum. Um, oh yeah, favorite boss fights, so... I don't know, I mean, like, there's got, I guess a lot of, uh, there'd be quite a few of my favourite boss fights from the whole Dark Souls series, because that's just, like, it's all about the boss fights. Like, probably Sister Frida in the DLC of Dark Souls 3, um, which I think is the only boss fight that's got three phases. That's, like, super cool. Um... See, that's the thing, it's like, I mean, I, like, like, it might be, I mean, I guess it could be underwhelming now if you play it today for the first time and, and you've already experienced the last 20 years worth of, like, you know, quality of life improvements or whatever, but obviously if you played it at the time, no one at the time called it underwhelming. Like, at the time, it was absolutely groundbreaking, like... You know, the fair, the, this was like the frontier of 3D games. Um, so it was like absolutely phenomenal at the time. Love the Illusion of Time playthrough. Yeah, I thought, was that the fair, was that the first time you arrived on the channel? I think it might have been. I can't remember. Oh, did you, oh no, Final Fantasy VI. Was it Final Fantasy VI, I think, when you arrived? Have you played the prequel Soul Blazer and Terra Enigma, which I believe is the sequel? I ha I haven't, but I've been, I I didn't even know that there was a prequel and sequel until I played Illusion of Time on the like I played Illusion of Time when I was a kid, and I thought that was it. It was just a standalone game, and then when I played it on the channel, everyone told me about the ones. Oh yeah, yeah, Dylan, I totally agree. It still is phenomenal. Um, like. It, it stood the test of time. If you if you say what you want to play, Ocarina of Time or Breath of the Wild, I'll, I'd pick Ocarina of Time. Or Ocarina of Time Twilight Princess. Ocarina of Time Wind Waker. <laughs> I'm going to pick Ocarina of Time. And the only kind of test, the, like, the only measure of how good a game is is how fun it is. 
it's got to be fun because I keep wanting to go back and play it. Like if you know, it's as simple as that, isn't it? Like <laughs> if if it's if it's fun, you want to go back and play it again. That's why I think, like I mean, that's a, t a testament to how good um, Dark Souls are, or how good they are in my opinion. I finished Dark Souls and then almost, and I did this with Hollow Knight as well, and did it with Cuphead. Like I finished it, and almost as soon as I finished it, I thought, I want to start again. Like just usually, like uh, I don't know, a lot of games feel like a bit of a slog to get to the end, and you're like, oh, by the time you finished it, you're like, yeah, I'm just happy I can tick it off and say it's done. But um, if you get to the end of a game and as soon as you finish it, you want to play it again, that's like, that's got to be a good sign. <clears throat> Ocarina of Time is my favourite Zelda game. Good pick, Aiden. <laughs> Good taste. Um, six. Yeah, then everyone back to the old playlist. Good. Good. Oh, you found you found Chrono Trigger recently, didn't you? Yeah, see you later, Katagan. No worries, man. Cheers for popping in. Oh, I'll see you tomorrow for uh, Bioshock. Um, we never got... Oh, yeah, we never got Terranigma here. Yeah, we, we didn't. Um... Do, 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 do. This went by quickly. Have fun watching today. Said Dobbs. Devos. Uh, yeah, it really did fly by. It flew by. Yes, that's what you do, Josie. Go watch the um, rest of the papers, please. And you might need to give me some tips because it's a swift ending. But um, my only thing, uh, the, my only um, thing is that when I get. When you get to the end of the series, be aware that I'm going to do it again. Um, I'm starting it again, fresh. Because um, I went terribly wrong. I broke all the rules. <laughs> it went downhill, so I'm going to start it again and play it differently. Um. Do, 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 do. Go on, revisit it, Josie. In fact, you, you know we can we can both do it, Josie. You revisit that, and I'll revisit Majora's Mask because I've been wanting to revisit Majora's Mask anyway. So I, I'll revisit Majora's Mask. You revisit Ocarina of Time, and then we'll uh, we'll <laughs> we'll have a chat. <laughs> right. Anyway, I'm gonna get some sleeps, peeps. Thanks everyone for coming along. Back at it again tomorrow night. Thank you again, Claudio, for uh, sponsoring, man. Really is massively appreciated, and um. Yes, I will see you all tomorrow for some Bioshock, hopefully. Good night, peeps.